Hi, I'm Sam. And I'm Meg. Today we're going to talk about post-surgical swelling and bruising, a natural side effect that concerns our patients. After facial surgery, it's important to ice for the first 24 hours to reduce swelling. It's also important to keep your head above your heart level for the first week. Icing your body after surgery is not practical. However, body swelling is easily hidden, so it's not as important. Homeopathics like Arnica and bromelain can be taken before and after surgery to help reduce bruising and swelling. Swelling migrates with gravity depending on your body position. If you're lying down, it goes to the sides. If you're standing, it travels down towards your feet. Swelling lingers longer in some procedures when compared to others. In an abdominoplasty, the swelling can hang out above the incision for several months. In a rhinoplasty, it can hang out in the nasal tip for a year or longer. Weak old facial swelling in thinner individuals actually looks good providing a softer, less angular look. However, it goes away. Swelling and bruising are separate entities of each other and are not equally proportionate in where they occur. The buildup of fluid can cause your skin to feel taut, which is a strange feeling. However, it's completely normal and goes away with time. Swelling after surgery is inevitable, but remember that it's harmless and it does not impact the long-term results of your surgery.